The MFA in Art and Humanities at the University of Dundee is an intensive one year long interdisciplinary course that brings together uh, artistic research and experimentation, theoretical thinking and critical making. The course has three unique features. At the University of Dundee in the Duncan of Jordan Stone College of Art and Design, which is in the Global 100, which means that it's in the top 1% in the world. Um, there are workshops and facilities that um, don't exist in many other institutions around the world, either due to spatial or financial constraints. So here you have facilities and workshops for printmaking, for woodwork, sculpture. You have also lens-based uh, workshops and of course the digital uh, make lab. The second unique feature is that we teach art history that is global, including the First Nations, so not just the Western canon. And there are modules from philosophy, English and film studies to choose from. So for example, you might be studying something like new materialism or uh, philosophies of imagination, um, autobiographics, which is autobiographical comics, or gender, um, um, gender-based studies. All of our teaching um, at Dundee is research-based, so you're taught by people who are experts in their field. I've been brought in because I have an expertise in sculptural practices, but I like working with a range of uh, students that work with diverse materials. But I really try to encourage students to be very experimental with materials and to think about their practice as um, practice-led and studio-led. The centre of my practice is the material of clay and I use that unfired and both fired as well. Um, my work is largely figurative and um, while I reference ideas of kind of classical sculptures and monuments, um, I'm really interested in this idea of unmonumentality and experimenting with materials. My recent research is in uh, philosophy of technology. I published a book in that field uh, last year called Exceptional Technologies. Uh, and in that book, I look at uh, failed artefacts, impossible technologies, uh, and merely imagined technologies. And I'm arguing basically that there's a lot more to philosophical thinking about technology than just ethics. My research and teaching interests are in modern and contemporary literature, particularly poetry. And I also research the relationship between literature and science and literature and visual art. And I have a particular interest in intermedial poetry, which is works which combine poetic text with visual art. And I was project leader for Poetry Beyond Text. Uh, this work is the first work when I arrived in Gendi. It's about displacement. My work investigates the liminality found in a thin place. A thin place is a location where the barrier between here and the other world, or the divine, is thinner. This piece of work um, is based on uh, a book by Jonathan Carey, 24-7, um, and it's about the economy of sleep. These mattresses came from uh, my own family, and I'm very interested in obsolescence. And when these mattresses were burnt, I found that the remnants of them, they were very figurative, and I decided to embody this for my research to take it into a sculptural realm. Our art project um, involved me walking around the city uh, taking aimless walks and collecting waste materials uh, from the city such as cigarette butts and as well as that taking sound recordings and drawings with those cigarette butts I then use them in my artwork and I uh, cast them in bronze to explore uh, a new perception, a new perspective of Dundee as a place and my experience in interacting with it. Our students have gone on to a variety of careers. Some of them are award-winning artists, others are designers. We also have curators, uh, people who help with uh, museum displays and exhibitions. Uh, many have also gone into teaching and further research. Uh, for example, pursuing either a practice-based or a theoretical PhD, since this course prepares students very well for further interdisciplinary study. Dundee is a thriving creative city. It is UK's only UNESCO city of design, uh, with many creative spaces such as the Dundee Contemporary Arts or the recently opened V&A.